Today I am going to discuss with you about trajectory. Trajectories. Right. This is or trajectories. Where I will be discussing with you about orthogonal trajectory. This is the name of our institute also. So it's a pet chapter of our institute you can say. Every restaurant has a dish on its name. So we have this chapter in our name trajectory education and trajectory right so this is a chapter on the name of our institute this is very important also so first of all i write the definition of trajectory what is meant by trajectory the definition goes like a curve which cuts every member of the given family of curves in accordance with some given law is called trajectory of the given family of curve in our chapter we are basically concerned about orthogonal trajectory orthogonal trajectory right we have to find orthogonal trajectory for a given family of curves so it will be orthogonal trajectory will be a curve which cuts every member of a given family perpendicularly orthogonally it cuts perpendicularly right it cuts it will cut orthogonal trajectory for a given family of curves is a set of curves which cuts every member of the given family of curves orthogonally or you can say perpendicularly that's called orthogonal trajectory write the definition if a curve cuts every member of given family of curves at right angles it is called orthogonal trajectory i'll give you an example suppose we have a family of concentric circle here lambda is the parameter suppose lambda is the parameter so it's going to represent a family of concentric circle. So what can be the orthogonal trajectory for the family of concentric circle? Let me draw the concentric circle first. This is the family of concentric circles. This can be lambda is 1, this can be 2, this is 3, 4. So the family of concentric circle. This is x, this is y, right? So it's a family of concentric circle. So a curve which is orthogonal to each of the member, which cuts the a curve, the set of curves or a curve which will be cutting this circle at right angle is given by will be given by the straight lines, something like this. Say this line, or if I make it show it by green color, it will be these set of lines, these set of lines are intersecting these circles right this will be intersecting right be intersecting these curves this family of circles orthogonally the other green lines it will be intersecting these circles orthogonally right they are the family of straight lines these family of straight lines are represented by y equal to mx where m is a parameter so any one member of this family will be represent will be intersecting every member of this family perpendicularly or at right angles right so the orthogonal trajectory of this family of circle is a family of straight lines and vice versa also even each member of this family will be intersecting all the straight line given by this equation perpendicularly right this is a 90 degree it's a 90 degree so even the orthogonal trajectory of the family of straight line passing through the origin is going to be the family of concentric circle it's going to be the family of concentric circle orthogonal trajectory of the family of straight lines is going to be the family of concentric circle and vice versa orthogonal trajectory of the family of circles is going to be the family of straight lines Right. Now, mathematically, what is the procedure of finding this orthogonal trajectory? Method of what is method of finding orthogonal trajectory? Let's see that orthogonal see first of all you write you will be given write the equation first of all you write the equation 
of given family of curves right then you have to form a differential equation form the differential equation for given family occurs then in the differential equation you replace dy by dx with replace dy by dx with minus 1 by y dy by dx or minus dy by d, dx by dy and if you replace it you get the differential equation for for the orthogonal trajectory right and then you solve the equation of orthogonal trajectory to get the algebraic equation to get the algebraic equation right like this was your family or concentric circle right if I get the differential equation, this will be 2y, y dash equal to 0. So this is a differential equation of the family of concentric circle. Now, you replace y dash with minus 1 by y dash. So this is the differential equation of orthogonal trajectory. Now we have to solve this. So this gives you dx by x and that will give you y equal to mx where m is arbitrary parameter. So you see the family of straight line is the orthogonal trajectory of the family of circles. Similarly I can proceed vice versa also the orthogonal trajectory of the family of straight lines then also what I can do is I have to find out first the differential equation of the family of straight lines so dy by ds is m so I'll put it over here this will be dy by dx into, into x in order to get orthogonal trajectory I replace dy by dx with minus dx by dy that gives the equation of the orthogonal trajectory. So this will be and if you solve this you get where well, lambda is arbitrary constant. So this family of straight line the orthogonal trajectory is x square plus y square equal to that is family of concentric circles. This is how we find the orthogonal trajectory. This is how we find the